Hi guys, welcome to Cloud Tech. In this video, I'm going to show you how to find the length of the last word in a given string. Okay, let us consider this welcome to Cloud Tech as an input string. And I have to find the last word and calculate the length of that word. So in this string, we have Cloud Tech as a last word. And I have to find length of this Cloud Tech. So as this Cloud Tech word contains nine characters, so the length of this word is nine. And that should be my output. Okay, if there are some spaces in my string, I need to ignore those spaces and I need to calculate or find the length of the last word. Okay, so let me start writing the code. Uh, I have declared a class, find length of the last word. And uh, inside that, I have written a main method, which is going to be starting point for my program execution. Okay, now what I will do, I will declare a variable which will be used to calculate the length. So I will initialize it with zero and i will declare a variable which will be my string so string s equal to welcome to cloud tech this will be my input string now what i have to do i have to find the last words and calculate the length of that word okay so to find the last word or to calculate the word of la uh, length of last word what i will do i will try to iterate the string from the last okay so let me start iterating over the string for integer i is equal to s dot length minus one. This s dot length minus one will point to the last character in my string. Then i should be greater than or equal to zero and i minus minus. Okay. So before iterating over this thing, what I will do, if there are some spaces, let us consider there is a space in my string and I need to ignore those spaces. Okay, so you, to ignore this space, what I will do, I will use stream function. The stream function removes trailing and leading characters from the string. So s dot trim will remove all the spaces which are at the start or at the end of the string. Now I got a string without spaces. Now I will try to iterate over this string and I will see if there is a space in the string if there is a space in the string i will break my for loop otherwise i will count these characters by using this length a variable so i will simply increment this length variable if there is no space okay so what i will do i will check if s dot char at i is equal equal to space if it is a space then i have to come out of my loop Otherwise, what I have to do, I have to simply increment my counter. So this will count the number of characters in the last one. Okay. Now I'm done with the for loop. Simply what I will do, I will try to print the value which is inside the length variable. So length of the last word is the value of length variable. Okay. Now let me run this program and see what will be the output. So you can see a length of the last word is nine because we have welcome to cloud tech. We have removed the spaces from this string and we have calculated length of the last word that is cloud tech. That's it from this video guys. Uh, if you like this video, please like, share and subscribe. That will motivate me to create more videos like this. Thank you. Bye bye.